Hi, and welcome to another episode of Beers with Bill and Rods. It's a very special episode because it is a patriotic holiday, Memorial Day weekend. Here we are talking about the Amarillo Armadillo and the Lex 485 from Napoleon Grills. Perfect weekend for grilling, perfect weekend for having a cold one. Let's talk about the beer first. Amarillo Armadillo comes from Greenbrush Brewing uh, in Sawyer, Michigan. This is 6.3 alcohol by volume. That's a good smell coming right off the top there. Now here's the thing. When I purchased this one to review, I did not realize that it was a limited offering, a one-time bottle, no longer being bottled. So I'm gonna savor this because it's gonna be enjoyable. Let's take a look here. Oh yeah, we got a nice hazy uh, golden color with this uh, American pale wheat ale Woo! look at that nice off-white head on the top real stiff on the foam it's gonna have a nice body to that I can tell you that much we're gonna let this guy rest and we're gonna talk about the grill so with the grill we have a height of 49 inches with the lid closed we have a width of 61 and 3 quarters inches and a depth of 27 and a quarter. We have 815 total square inches of grilling capacity. So you have lots of room for all your party planning that you have. 74,000 BTUs are created on this beautiful piece of machinery. Uh, we have four burners, or sorry, six burners if we count the back rotisserie and the side infrared grill burner here. Uh, the ceramic infrared side burner has 1800 degrees and it gets there in 30 seconds. That's the same temperature Ruth Chris sears their steaks at. It's a beautiful temperature to be at. You have an eye glow um, background on these knobs with a flip of a switch. You've got some lights back there. You have the stainless steel wave rod design on the grids. Um, that's going to give it a very unique and distinct pattern on your whatever it is that you're cooking. Jet fire ignition on all of these. So as you turn it, it creates a spark and it's gonna fire up. So no reliance on batteries in order to start your main burners. You do have an electric start for your side and your rotisserie burner. Uh, the whole thing is out of, the whole head here is made out of 430 grade stainless steel. That's a high grade stainless steel. No magnets are gonna stick to that. All right, let's come back over here to the beer and check it out. We've got, we've got a good look to that um, and a good, Good stiff head again, as we were saying. It is nice. You do get a lot of citrus here. You do get the pine resin very heavy uh, with this brew as well. That would come from the Amarillo hops that we have here. Um, it's a nice uh, earthiness from the yeast and you do get a little bit of floral grassy finish very complex with the flavors very deep um, you don't get the astringent flavors of alcohol being at it's 6.3 percent alcohol by volume uh, but it's a nice crisp smooth finish um, that lingers nicely on your palate so if you want to try a nice beer this weekend Try and get your hands on some of this Amarillo Armadillo from Green Bush Brewing Company in Sawyer, Michigan. If you don't have a grill yet, we've got these in stock at this very current moment. Um, but this is the Lex 485 from Napoleon. This has the RSI BPS. That is the infrared side burner and infrared rear burner. Stop in and see us. We're at 15870 Middle Belt Road in Livonia, Michigan. Uh, again, I'm Joe and this is Beers with Bill and Rods. If you have a beer that you'd like me to try, shoot me a message. I'd love to try it. If you have a product you want me to look at, I'd love to do that as well. Thank you and have a great and safe weekend.